What's up? Good morning, good morning. What it do, y'all? We are back. It is officially Monday. We're getting into this crazy, crazy work. Last week was kind of a little hectic, a little all over the place. It was lady time. So you know how that be when it comes to the gym and working out. But it's a new week. We starting off fresh and I'm hella excited. I'm actually about to get ready to link up with my homie Salu and get this boxing workout done and i am scared i'm very scared usually mondays are my leg days i still might hit legs later on today but we're gonna see how this boxing workout goes i've trained with salu before and he tries to kill me every time every time <laughs> So I know that it is gonna be a tough killer workout. I haven't trained with him in a while and I know that he's just coming to destroy me. And I'm so excited, scared and excited at the same time because I love boxing, I love fighting. That's my favorite form of workout. That's what I grew up doing all of my life. So it just reminds me of being home. Salud reminds me of like one of my brothers, one of my cousins. So I'm ready to just hear him talk hella shit. Uh, so yeah, I've got a busy day today. Um, I'm gonna get ready, head out there, go do that workout. I got a few clients in between. It's Monday and I might hit a leg day. Maybe, like I said, we're gonna see how the boxing class goes. So get up, get ready. It's motherfucking Monday. Get that workout in. By the time y'all see this, it's gonna be like a whole nother day. Hopefully I drop it on a Monday, but Mm, who knows? Anyways, we about to go work out. Let's go! Add that two behind. So two behind. There you go, Jack. Jack. Good morning. It's the morning time. Your girl got new lashes. Mm -hmm. Get into it. Yep, your girl look good. But it is freaking freezing cold today. Um, today is Tuesday, usually upper body, but yesterday I did boxing with Salu and I told you guys he killed me. We still got story time about that, but it's early in the morning. We're about to get into a leg workout, so it is going to be quaddies and gluteys that we are going to be working on today. Super excited, and I am planning on bringing you guys on this full workout, so let's see how this thing goes. Hopefully, the gym isn't too packed and crazy, and we can actually do it, but...
measuring it. I'm just doing how much I want. <laughs> Honestly. But like I'm trying to eye is about three fourths. I'm gonna do just a touch more because it be hitting and I'm really hungry. So boom. Next, some honey. You can do as much or as little as you like. Me, I'm like in the middle. I don't want it like not sweet at all, but I don't want it like overly sweet. So that's about as much as I did. I try to do about a serving size, so about a tablespoon, I feel like that is. I'm just gonna mix that up because the honey is for the yogurt. I get plain Greek yogurt, no sugar, no fat. And then I sweeten it myself because I want to control the flavors and I want to be able to put it in other dishes. Like, you know what I'm saying? So I don't want to have like vanilla bean all the time. I got some granola. I need to get more granola. This is just a, I don't even know. I got this a minute ago. This is like a pumpkin seed maple sunflower grain fruit. I don't even know. This is like some type of pumpkin. Pumpkin maple granola. Let's put a good amount in there. I'm eyeballing everything, but if I was to guesstimate, because I cook a lot, I would say that's like one and a half to two tablespoons of the granola in there. So bam, next pomegranate seeds. Pomegranate seeds are in season. So I'm just doing pomegranate seeds. You can get them from Whole Foods already done. These are pomegranates that I took out of just like a whole pomegranate and I just bust them out. Pop a few of them in the mouth. Yeah, just put a lot of them in there. They're good for you. Boom. So we got the pomegranate seeds. Next. So I keep my blueberries. Need more. So, nice little handful of blueberries. And I already cut up these little strawberries, so then I'm just gonna add these strawberries. And that's what I'm saying, it's giving Captain Crunch, like, you know, the one with the fruit, and then the granola is like the taste of the cereal itself. Boy! Y'all see that? Let me get that. You want a little extra honey, you can put some on top, but come on now. Come on now, quick, easy, you can make this like beforehand, pop this mug in the refrigerator and just grab and go. Grab and smash this. Easy piece. Um, so yeah, your girl just got back from the jism. Great workout. I pretty much recorded most of everything that I did. Um, yeah, your girl is in the gym today, working out. Um, I feel like my body low key been getting, I say like been getting, like I've been doing this for a lot. Yesterday I did boxing, I told, keep telling y'all about it, so I guess now I'm gonna have the story time. So, I told y'all, grew up boxing, doing kickboxing, all that stuff. So, one of my homies, his name is Salu. He is a rumble coach and then just an amazing, amazing, amazing boxing coach. He works at JLT. He everywhere. He all over the place. But um, so I linked up with him and we did mitt work. And me and Salu was working together probably like a couple, like two, three months ago. And at that time, I, your girl was in crazy shape. Okay. I was, <laughs> let's do it. Um, and then after we stopped, I literally kind of more like stopped working out like super crazy hard in general. So your girl been getting like lazy and working out at the gym, like lifting weights is completely different from 
throwing hands, boxing workouts, is cardio, stamina, excuse me, arms, back, shoulders. That shit is, that shit crazy. That's lucky why you see the uh, shoulders right now. You see the shoulders right now? Sore. Um, but yeah, so pulled up on Salu and <sighs> see, this is why trainers can't follow you on the ground. Cause they know what you got going on and then they like torture you based on that. <laughs> they don't on purpose, but you know, they know what's going on. So of course, Thanksgiving, I was having the time of my life. I was eating good, real good. And uh, Salu was like, yeah, I seen you eating good. Yeah, we about to put that work in. Wow. And I don't even, he didn't even really go too hard. I was just so <laughs> not in boxing shape, not in that kind of shape that your girl was dead. I was, I was dead on the floor, dead. So um, yeah, he killed me. I was hard, like. I had to tell my dog to stop. Like I was like, bro, break time. I never do break, like for real. Like I'm one of the people that's like, shoot, I might be tired, but I ain't gonna say it. You ain't gonna catch me. But this time I say, yeah, your girl need a break. So he gave me so many breaks. He tried to kill me with one of the combos because Something just don't play. So going into the combo and um, you know, you got one of the combos left, you got three of the combos left. But if you mess up, he's starting that bad boy back over. Do you know when you tired, you just stop thinking? So your girl is messing up. So we go from, all right, three combos, boom, boom, boom. All right, two combos, boom, 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 boom. Nah, you fucked up. Back to three, boom, 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 boom. All right, two, boom, 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 boom. One, boom, that shit ugly. Three, boom, boom. I said, how? How, Sway? I can't even get to three. And now you want me to do nine? Nine of them? Pretty much. It was my fault because I was dead and I wasn't thinking about the combination. And I was throwing whatever and yeah. It was just a lot. It was hard for you, girl. At the end of the workout. Oh, and then we was on that one treadmill that you operate on your own. I call it the hamster wheel treadmill because you got to push it yourself. <sighs> your girl don't run. Okay, well, we're going to put that out there right now. I don't run. Um, when I was at my peak of working out the top of the year, your girl was doing a lot more cardio. Your girl was hitting sprints. Since summertime, your girl ain't hitting a sprint. I ain't touch no sprint. I've been doing a nice little incline walk with not holding the sides. That's what your girl been on for the last, like, pretty much half of the year. So, when we did a finisher, and he wanted me to run on that treadmill for three minutes. One, I was already tired from the boxing. I was dead. Then you want me to do three, two rounds, three minute intervals on the hamster wheel. I didn't even finish the first three minutes. I had to stop. I had to walk. The second three minutes, I don't even remember that set. I don't even remember it. Because your girl was walking, okay? I would like hit a light draw like this. And then your girl would be walking. Like, Salu was like, wow. Wow. And then like... He's super big on like trying to see me sweat. Cause I'm not a huge sweater. But he got the sweat up out me that time. That sweat came up out me on that little uh treadmill. After that, I got off, I laid myself on the floor, and I was like, it's over. Thank you, Jesus. And then so I looked at me and said, You better get up off that flow. <laughs> That is not what we're doing here. You is not dead. So I had to get up off that flow. But yeah, that was my workout. Your girl was sore for the whole day. That was usually my upper body day. I was gonna hit legs yesterday. It was not happening, okay? That boxing workout took your girl out. That's why I highly, 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 highly recommend Doing some fun stuff, doing some fun type of exercises. You ain't gotta be like lifting weights all day. Like for me, lifting weights is low key new. I ain't start doing that until I moved out to California, living on my own, no more, no longer going to like my family's gym. 
Um, before I just play sports and you know body weight exercises and boxing but it had me shredded it had me leaned out i still had a booty like people look at my arms like you can't see it because i got these long sleeves on but you see your girl is taunt now your girl is taunt now but the arms is really from boxing like of course lifting weights because i do it too but you want to slim that bit down and then also learn a great skill for yourself get the cardio in build your stamina work your shoulders work your arms work your back work your core because when you're throwing them you're twisting you're turning you're getting hella obliques in there you're getting resistance training because you're hitting the mitts and you're getting that resistance back especially if you're hitting with somebody like salu he's trying to take your hand out you know what I'm saying? Um, it's just such a good workout. So, so happy to be back into just boxing in general. That's going to be in the routine regardless. Uh, but yeah, that's my little story time. Uh, so, get in the gym. Don't be scared. Like, even if you want, like, 24 LA Fitness, they got little bags hanging. Get you some gloves. And then hit like a round of three minutes of just hitting the bag. You get so much anger out during this time. Like me, I be envisioning my boyfriend's face. Like especially if he like piss me off or something. And I go crazy. I love my man though. So. But you know, whatever you got to do to get there. <laughs> but your job, your boss, your manager, imagine their face and go crazy. And I like to do that for like three rounds. So like three minutes on, one minute off, take a little break, three minutes back, punch that bit like crazy. Your arms gonna go be nice and toned. You're gonna be able to get some cardio in. I like to kind of do it with like jump ropes. So I'll jump rope three minutes, punch back three minutes, punch, jump rope three minutes, punch the back for three minutes. Killer. I'll probably put that in one of these videos on one of these days, but right now I'm actually going to like boxing. So I don't need to do it at the moment, but yeah, major key, major key. If you want to, uh, you can join the classes, Rumble, Box Union, you know, all them vibes. But any hoots, you girl hungry. I'm about to kill this little yogurt. Delish. And then I got to get ready and head out to go to work literally in like 30 minutes. So yeah, have a good one. I hope y'all enjoyed this workout. I hope y'all enjoyed this little chitty chatter. And yeah, let's get it. Alrighty, so we got some meal prep going. I ended up buying turkey wings. So we got them bad boys just in the oven with some seasoning. We got some homemade yellow vegetable rice quinoa blend and some sweet potatoes. I leave some leftovers that I had. And uh, I love a little tomato cucumber salad, you know what I'm saying, for like Mediterranean bowls. So I just throw that in. So that's what I got so far. All right, so I know this dish might look a little bit more beige, but these are the turkey wings that I had. So I had some turkey wings. I reheated them in the oven with um, some just frozen green beans, some roasted potatoes that I cooked, and the bell peppers. So this is what I'm gonna have for dinner. Just veggies, potatoes, and turkey wings. Turkey wings. So yeah, this is. Hey, your girl is here. Um, today's been pretty hectic, but I got a quick workout in this morning. It was like upper body kind of cardio vibes. Um, I ended up doing one of my dad's uh, workout tapes, so bust that out because I was kind of crunchy on time today. Went to work, did a few clients, and now I'm back home. And your girl got food. Remember I mentioned doing the meal prep, so... I came home, I pulled out the chicken that I marinated yesterday, and I grilled it, and I made one of my favorite dishes that I love, 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 love to make. So, I'm gonna show y'all. It is a Mediterranean style chicken bowl. I would normally probably put this in a bowl, but I ain't really got that many bowls like that, or like big bowls. So, it's on a paper plate, cause yeah, your girl is, <laughs> Moving quick and fast, but yeah, so let's get into it. 
We got our Mediterranean bowls. Say hey to this old lady, she did. Light better on this side, yes, chicken Mediterranean bowl. So this is the chicken thighs that I just grilled. I put four ounces on there. Then I have some of that veggie rice that I made last night. It's uh, rice and quinoa mixed, and I made it kind of like yellow rice with like peas and veggies in there. We got a little salad on the bottom, our tomato cucumber salad that we made last night. Cucumbers, tomatoes, parsley, red onions, lime, or I think lemon, salt, pepper, easy. A little kraut, and then this red bell pepper hummus that I love. So yeah, that's like one of my just quick easy meal preps. Um, I sometimes have time to come home, so then I'll be able to make it. But the chickens now, it's all cooked. Everything's cooked, so I just throw it all together. So yeah, so that's what your girl's having for lunch. And yeah, so I'm just about to eat that, um, get some more like work done, and that's about it. Come on, come on, bo. Come on, Bo. We about to play it up. We about to play it up. So, oops, I don't know what that was. Oh.